here's another long overdue uh, video. Uh, a year ago I'd uh, emailed uh, Cutworm59 and uh, told him that I was going to post a video of a gun that I thought he might uh, be interested in. Here we are a year later, I'm running way behind on everything. But this is a uh, L.A. deputy. It's a knockoff of a Colt. And uh, from actually, I, I researched it a while back. It's made in Germany. And uh, I didn't find much back on, on it a while back, but now I found some stuff that said they were sold for like $29 to $39 back in the 60s. And uh, this gun has been uh, in my family for since at least 1979 that I know of. Because in uh, 19, actually it was 1980, but I knew he had it before then. My brother used to take this gun and he would carry it on a paper route that he did. He'd leave on Saturday nights and, and uh, do about a 300 mile paper route taking the Sunday morning paper around to uh, big cities and he carried this in his van and one time in 1980 he uh, got out of the van and uh, this little loop over the trigger was the hammer wasn't hooked on and it uh, fell out of the holster and shot him through the right leg when it landed on the hammer and went off. So anyway, uh, that's how I know he had it in 1980 and he passed away in 2002 and um, I ended up with a gun. I'm not a big gun person but I did keep this gun and since bought a couple other handguns but uh, Cutworm has a gun similar to this. And uh, he was shooting a pumpkin with it one day. But uh, let me see if I can rig up a, a tripod or something and we'll go from there. Okay, I'm going to try this one time. Uh, there's the gun. It's uh, 22 caliber. Made in Germany. And here on the, I don't know if you'll be able to see that. It says L.A. Deputy. <clears throat> it does have the uh, serial number made in Germany. And uh, the only thing about this gun that I don't shoot it very often. I don't shoot often anyway. But uh, to load the shells, you have to line up the cylinder on each shell. And then to eject the shell, there's a manual lever right here. And you have to line that up to expel the, uh, I think you can see the little rod coming out. That kicks out the, ex uh, ex expel the used shell. Uh, I don't know, it's not in the greatest shape. I keep it around because it was my brother's and uh, maybe one of these days I'll get some videos showing shooting it but uh, anyway I wanted to show this to Cutworm. Uh, sorry it took so long to get a video up. Thanks for watching.